Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. So today I am going to be doing an eyeshadow tutorial using my Nomad Okavango Safari palette. So this is just a really nice neutral palette, a few pops of green in there, and I just feel like I haven't reached for this one too much this year, so I wanted to pull it out and create a look for you all. Alright, the first shade I want to take is Towering Giraffes. And I'm going to just start by running this one through my crease. I think I want to stick with the more neutral shades today. Just because I feel like I've done quite a few looks with the more green shades in this palette. If I remember, I will pop up some pictures of other looks I've created with this palette. I have had so much fun creating looks with this one and... I just really like the color combo. I am definitely someone who loves neutrals, but I also really love green eyeshadow, so this combo is just perfect. I do want to go really kind of smoky with this look, so I'm going to just be working from light to dark. This is just a really nice initial transition shade right here, but we are definitely going to work on deepening this look up. All right, next I want to take Crash of Rhinos. And this is a little bit of a green toned brown shade. But I didn't really want to go with the true warm tone kind of chocolatey brown shade that this palette has. I wanted to stick a little more true neutral instead of warm. And I'm working on just kind of smoking out this outer corner and when there's less product on the brush, bringing it more through the crease. All right, the next I want to take Honking Hippos. And once again, just going to use this to start deepening up the crease, just focusing a little bit lower each time I go in with a new shade. So Nomad just started teasing their new release, and I'm so excited to see what this one is. It looks like it's going to be very tropical and I'm really, really hoping that it's Florida Keys theme because that will just kind of be an automatic purchase for me. I will make sure I like the color story, but I love the keys and I've been there many times. So having a palette that was themed for that would be so much fun. But we still have to wait and see. The reveal has not happened yet. I am filming this the day before I'm posting this, so they just released their first clue for the palette. So the guessing game has just started, but I'm super excited to see what they come out with. Alright, next I want to take Rumbling Elephants. And I'm going to use this one in the outer corner to deepen. And I'm going to be bringing this kind of along my lash line a little bit. And then creating a little bit of a C shape in this outer corner, as well as bringing it onto my lower lash line. I just want to add some nice depth to this outer corner. And then I'm going to go back in with the previous matte shades and just work on the blend between all of them. Alright, then I want to take Mighty Buffaloes. And I did wet my brush for this shade. And I want to take it from the outer corner across most of the lid. I'm going to leave just a little part open in the inner corner for a different shade. But I want this one to be kind of the main star of the lid. Alright, then I'm going to take this pinkish shimmer shade. And I did go ahead and wet my brush with this one as well. And I'm going to be putting this in the inner corner and then onto that open space we left on the lid. This is not a shade I have used for my inner corner yet. And I know it's not going to be one I typically use just because it is a little darker than I would go for. But I wanted to just add in a little pop right here of a different color. And just connect it with that shade on the lid. Alright, I did go ahead and put on some mascara. So this is the final look. 
I really like how this one came out. I think it's just a really nice brown smoky eye. Maybe not the most exciting look, but I think it is still really pretty and I really like that brown shimmer that is all over the lid. I feel like, especially in person, it has a few different flakes of color in it, so I think that is super pretty. So let me know what you guys think of this look. Please let me know what else you would like to see from me. Give this video a thumbs up if you did enjoy. Be sure to subscribe so you don't miss out on any future uploads. And with all of that said, I will see you in my next video. Bye!